We got a lot of shoes there, huh? Mm -hmm. huh? Almost too much. We got, this is our third batch of shopping we've done for shoes. So, see here we got some flip-flops. Uh, we got some women's shoes. But we're really trying to stretch out our our dollar here to get as many people as we can taken care of. Uh, thank God that Kmart is actually um, teaming up with us and they're going to give us uh, a little bit of a discount on some of our shoes so we can buy more. And you can see we got one, two, three, four, five, six carts full of shoes. I cannot believe the amount of support we got from Kmart. Big, big, big shout out to them. I mean, we have our car full of shoes. We won't. We only would have had the back trunk full of shoes if it was uh, with the money that we had. And I mean, they they did like buy one get one free on some. I mean, we we spent about maybe less than five hundred dollars for all these pairs of shoes. There's got to be probably like maybe two hundred pairs of shoes back there. Really quick, what are in the bags that we put together? It's actually kind of cool. So. Oh, let's open up one of these guys here. This is nothing huge, you know, it's just a, a smaller book bag, very lightweight. So um, we put some, you know, some sunscreen in there. Uh, we've got some uh, some toothpaste, some hand sanitizer, because, you know, they're walking all over the place. Some, uh, some deodorant. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. This is like a, like a little travel thing for, for the toothbrush. So, you know, just something simple. And um, also even uh, some razors to shave with. So, uh, most importantly, what we put in here I thought was pretty cool is one of these guys, the Word of God. And there's nothing wrong with it. It's all positive. And, hey, guess what? It's a love story. And we got a Channel 10 News. They're going to set up here and do some, some interviewing. Watch out, my show. You have a lot going on today. You're talking about cleaning their feet and a little lotion and all of this. Uh, after, I mean, what what do you expect to kind of feel like walking away from this? You got um, we just want to walk away from it knowing that we came together as a community, which we are. I got a bunch of friends coming out. We're going to wash feet of the homeless people and put some lotion on. Just make them feel great. Heavenly Father, Lord, we just want to praise you and thank you for all the that you would just bless this event, Lord, and that we just show the love of you, Father God. Thank you for all that you do in our lives, Lord, and may we just, we meet, may we demonstrate your love that you've shown the love to us. Paper towel, we're gonna rinse our feet off, or if you guys don't have a big jug like this, we got water bottles <coughs> all up lying there. Thanks, Rachel, mm -hmm. and Angela. Um, so what we're gonna do is after we, uh, we rinse them off, we're gonna put a little soap on there, Everybody should have a soap dispenser. Uh, and then after, after we're gonna towel dry their feet, give them a pair of socks and shoes. Oh, we got They're probably like looking at me like, yeah, I'm good. Don't touch. All right, let's try to get. There you go. Grab that. We got more. Are we good? Is there more? They coming. They coming. I need water. Here. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Do you have any more? Yeah. 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 You got some oh, hey, married or two kids and one girl or one of each? Yeah. Hey, it's your boy Richie behind the camera. We're here at the live. I'm uh, in the, in, actually in the van right now where you can see the live feed. So they're going to go live in the next uh, five, six minutes. Responsibility to try and get this access to the Monday workshop, the local officials listen to different testimonies about how the new law should be carried out. 
such as who should be able to the search the they the one to look at all the times what they do after they go to the space video of him giving shoes to homeless people in Tampa has gone viral. Today, he does it again, but even bigger. He and dozens of volunteers are bathing the feet of homeless people and then fitting them with new socks and shoes. Tennis reporter Danica Lawrence introduced... Hey guys, I'm here with Estelle and um, she uh, she helps run Amazing Love Ministries. Every Monday they put this together. They These guys right here are the real heroes. I mean, what we did is just very, very minor of what these guys do on a consistent weekly basis. So uh, this is Estelle. I thank her for being able to come over here and help minister, asking for God to shed his blessings on what they have planned here in the future. Thank you so much. And you are underestimating the effect that you have on our friends downtown. Uh, you have been a true blessing for each and every one of them today. It was awesome. It was a very humbling experience, and we thank you so much. All right, did do that since my kids were all of you. Your mom just turned seven. Oh, really? My little girl. Oh, wow. My little one's floating around here somewhere. She's, uh, she's going to be ten. Seems like she was seven years old. Wait, he's just tagging off. I just want to make sure they're on the right side. Oh, you got them? Yeah. Actually, a twelve. That's what you, you wanted, right? A twelve? Fresh smelling. Yeah. How about that? There you go. Number one no, no, it's, it's real on the tip. Oh my God. Low socks and high socks. Oh, and I'm ticklish, so this should be interesting. <laughs> Spread love around, and that's the problem we lack in. You know, and, um, and this, and I ain't gonna lie to you, not me, it's all God and Omar. You know, I mean, and like, we spoke about this. We stuttered for a bit because I'm kind of in shock still, but God is good all the time.